Good morning, folks, and welcome back to another edition of Wells Fargo Friday. We're still here with Gil from Wells Fargo Bank and Jeremy from CDFI, and I left off earlier because I still have more questions for you. I really, really want to dig into the heart of what you do because Wells Fargo is so big on volunteerism. I mean, over 600 of their employees are volunteering here in the community with different nonprofits. So tell me more about your involvement in that. Well, basically my involvement here with the CDFI is um, I, I take time to go through their Jeremy's write-ups and uh, review the, take a, a financial analysis of the credits that um, are being proposed, um, ensure that you know, the, if they make financial sense, um, we help mitigate risk, and uh, put together the right structure that will not only work for the CDFI as a lender, but it work for the client and be able to provide a, a, a proper repayment structure that will work for everybody involved. Now, Jeremy, you actually, you look to Gil for a lot of advice because you're just starting out, he's got some experience, and so he's a little bit of a mentor for you. I mean, you... I think we're about, I think we're about the same age, but I, he's still kind of like a big brother to me because, you know, I, I joined CDFI as, as a loan officer with very little training. I mean, I, I joined it because I wanted to be part of a nonprofit loan fund. I like the idea of interacting with, non, with uh, business owners, um, like the owners here of Candy Solteca. And, um, but see, I, did, I lacked a little bit of training, you know, I was a little green. So um, having, having Gil there, other loan committee members, but you know, Gil has been so great. I give him a call, hey, help, I need some, need some help on this, uh, this little write up here, what would you do? And he's been so just forthcoming with, with support and help on that. I think, I, for me personally anyway, when I think of loans and when I think of big banks, I think that there's these big corporations, all kinds of paperwork, it's just going to get lost in the shuffle, and it's so refreshing to hear that you two work so closely together that he just picks up the phone and calls you and has a conversation. Absolutely. I think the, the thing that we take pride here at Wells Fargo is that we are a big bank, but we are a local community bank. You know, we uh, are not only myself, but like, as you mentioned, 600 other team members here in Central Valley. You know, we provide a lot of resources to the community and other nonprofits. And I think that's why we take pride in being, and we like to call ourselves a community bank because we are. We give back in a big way. Yeah, I mean, you're so involved in the community. In fact, I was just reading some numbers, and the team members over at Wells Fargo donated well, really, it's donated 19,000 hours last year alone of their time, 19,000 hours of their own personal time to help out other community members and other community projects. That's huge. Absolutely. Absolutely. It feels really good to give back to the community that we serve. And uh, not only do I sit on the CDFI board, but there are a number of the boards that I, uh, I participate in as well. Um, you know, the key is to give back. Giving back. Wells Fargo gave me back. And CDFI is a part of that, too. You know, one of our key services to the community is providing financial literacy, financial training to uh, small business owners that that may not have had that kind of training. They they don't have MBAs, you know, and so they're they're going into this with a lot of heart, and they you know they're starting their own business, but they need to catch up a little bit maybe with with learning fi how to do financials or whatever it is. Um, our partnership with Wells Fargo has really helped us um, in that, in, in, in giving that financial literacy because we're able, we're trained on what to train the small business owners because ultimately what we want to see them do is go to, go to Wells and get a loan from Wells. Be able to, absolutely, yeah, go to Wells, go to another bank, you know, their, their regular bank, whatever it is, we want to see them prosper. You know, we're not the be all and end all, we get that. And Wells is helping us bridge these small business owners to a larger, you know, the bigger picture. So you're not just providing loans at Wells Fargo, you're providing a helping hand. Absolutely. That's what I like about it. And it's local, everybody. That's what, that's what the key thing here is that Wells Fargo likes to help local business owners. In fact, the owner of Candy Stolteca was telling me that they started in their living room. So it's businesses like that that Wells Fargo, CDFI, and other organizations are really trying to hammer down on. So I am going to help myself out now and have one of these stick around a little more Valley Life just ahead. Oh. 